inside you. I'm trying to get a tan. Oh, my goodness. How you look like this trying to play basketball? Um, because I have to do some content afterwards. You want me to, I'm the content uh, taker? Yep. I'm about to teach you how to play basketball. You can try. I'm just big for nothing. <laughs> My name is Mulan. I'm a college athlete, basketball influencer, and all around bad bitch. Today I felt like I wanted to get in the gym, get loose, so I got a few drills I'm gonna show you guys, and I'm gonna start with form shooting. Here we go. I've been doing basketball content for about two years now. I feel like it's a way I can turn my passion into cash flow. Just go ahead and Go right over. I started playing basketball in the third grade, and as I got older, I noticed that it wasn't appreciated as much when it comes to women, so I made my own way for basketball, and I became an influencer. My basketball influencer content is just to really show my skills and kind of gravitate people who haven't seen girls like me be able to pick the ball up. Okay, you guys, now that I got my touch, you know I'm a little loose, I'm gonna go ahead and do like one dribble shot. Just little simple stuff. People do want to see girls who can do both. You know, can be a tomboy, can get cute, can glam it up, can be classy, and do it all in one. Now, my left hand is a little rusty, so don't judge me, okay? See, it's a little slower. But you still, still got it. Producing content 100% helped me, you know, get my life together, kind of focus on different things, and see a different perspective in life. Now that I'm turning it around and I'm making it into something positive, it's a really, really fun and good experience. And every time I pick a ball up, I kind of smile. Stay tuned for more content. Bye. Let's go. For the people in the middle, all the alley wanna bump and everybody who just paid the people snuck up in the trunk. For the people in the back, for the people in the front. What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Nick, and I'm back with another video. Yes, I'm having my very own, my first girls' night in Orlando. I'm going to bring y'all with me, but first, we're going to do, like, a little Get Ready With Me video. I'm about to try these clothes on and let y'all see what they look like. So, hold on real quick. I'll be right back. When I was younger, I used to watch a lot of vlogs and a lot of vloggers online, and then I just kind of fell in love with it and wanted to do it myself. Let me set y'all up. Ah! I'm going to do it right there. Okay. This outfit is really, really cute, but I feel like it's just too date nighty. You know what I mean? It's kind of giving like on a date with your man, not going out with your friend. I'm not trying to be a lady tonight. I'm just like, <laughs> this is the look. I'm not gonna lie, this surprised me. I actually like this a lot, a lot, a lot. We're gonna look sexy with the back out. When Dwayne came into my life, he definitely swept me off my feet. But creating content helped me be more independent. It's been my source of income since I had my son. And I think it's important for young girls to see someone like me standing on my own two feet. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. We're about to get to this turn up, so peace out. But you never seen a girl like me. I'm back at it again. Uh, Cause I look good. Girls night, I am ready for everybody to get up, get dressed, to look fine, and have a good time. I want to see a different side of everybody. I'm tired of seeing the, the bitter side. I want to see the fun, wild girl side. So I just made it to the restaurant. Nobody's here yet, but the vibe is so amazing. It's so cute. I'm super excited to see everybody. Let y'all meet them and vibe with them. Y'all comment down below who y'all favorite person is when I introduce them, OK? I got to introduce my vlog to y'all first. Out the vlog. Hey, Yes, I'm vlogging. Then we got Miss Nikki Nicole. Hello. She was literally my body goals. I'm like, I really? look like her when I get older. Yeah. But you got it though. Thanks. Okay, you guys. So we got this super cutie Colin. He's making us a dragon in the bag. I got the real dragon. What made you do this? I was influenced a lot by like social media and like who I was dating. And I didn't think like what I preferred. <sighs> this is the same reason I don't let boyfriends and husbands pick implant sizes, right? That's a great My results great last point. longer than most of those relationships. <laughs> you gotta you gotta do what's right for you. You gotta love yourself. Yes, for sure. 
I definitely am using my platform to show people that you need to do your research before you touch your body, and then what God gives you is amazing. I know a lot of people are scared to talk about things like this, but I didn't have anyone to tell me not to do things so young. It's not about how you look, it's about how you feel. Now that I built my brand, it doesn't matter what I do to my body, as long as I love myself, I will always trend. Do it all for my city, do it all for my crew. Did it for all hit wonder. <laughs> I'm someone who prefers to have fun in my life instead of having fights. And lately, all the arguing with the friend group is beginning to be too much. Ooh. I want everybody to get along in a way where it's all about fun, kind of how me and Mulan be when we hang out.